There are also caves and ruins of abandoned settlements, fortresses and churches in Chicago. We are told that this path takes us to the ancient shrine. The dominating elevations are 1,400 to 1,800 meters and the slope declivities are 30 to 40 degrees. Visitors should be physically well fit to climbing over these slopes. We reach this abandoned ancient chapel in the depth of the forest. A mysterious place indeed. spring spurred from beneath the church basement is believed to heal scabies. For this reason it is called Ksajur, meaning water for healing scabies. The ruins of settlement and tombstones are scattered nearby. We are again traveling uphill, crossing canyons and gorges, where cold mountain springs flow and animal graze. We have reached the next elevation. Summer has decorated the slopes and valleys with colorful flower carpets. The beauty, colors, and fragrance of flowers create the heavenly feelings, making us believe that this is a lost paradise. Having successfully overcome a difficult mountain pass, it is surely pleasant to take a cold shower, especially when water is messaging and refreshing the tired body. Swimming opens up the appetite. You can enjoy this beauty for hours. Everywhere is natural wilderness, rich in plants and animals. The flowers are blossoming. The forests are full of fragrance and the music of twittering birds. Life is in full swing.
The summer storm is coming up. The smell of rain is in the air. The summer is coming to the end and the autumn is beginning. The surveys go on. Together with rangers, we should move up again for observations. The road descends to Arabic National Park in the Maghri district. Here is Mehri, the southern gates of Armenia. It is an ancient settlement landmarked by ancient churches, cyclopean fortresses and monuments. The cypress, pomegranate, persimmon and other subtropical plants grow at about 700 meters above sea level. The harvest is plentiful this year. People gather and process fruits for winter. From 2,180 meters above sea level, we can view the roads leading from Mehri to Iran. Just here, a leopard was glimpsed while moving from Iran to Armenia. The transparent, crystal clear air is full of smell of mountain plants. This rare crocus will stay underneath the snow until the next spring. Wild plums have borne good fruit this year. Hopefully birds will eat them to survive the winter. The most delicious rose heaps can be tasted here. The sun goes down and the sunset spreads over the peaks of Shikaho. This peace and serenity have been guarded by giant cliffs for centuries. The sun is setting and touching the mountain. The shadow of the mountain is touching the rock. The shadow of the rock is touching the tree. The shadow of tree moves behind the rock and prolongs and longs along the hollow and grows into a miraculous morrow. <laughs>